We would like to invite customers traveling with small children to board. If you have a stroller or car seat, please sit at the boarding door at this time. We gotta go. All right, we are finally ready to go. Got some packing done this morning. It is really early and uh, we stayed up super late last night. Katie probably got a good hour of sleep max. Maybe an hour. Haley, for whatever reason, did not want to go to sleep last night and poor Katie was up with her a lot. I probably got two and a half hours, three hours of sleep. So we ended up running around this morning like normal, trying to get everything together, trying to film, trying to be on time. We're actually headed to Newark, New Jersey, which is an hour and a half away because the flights were way cheaper. But we're finally ready to go. Say hi, Haley. Are you ready for this, Haley? She looks ready. She's wide awake and ready to go. We're waiting on my mom right now. She's going to take us to the airport, uh, saying bye to Remy. But it's going to be a challenge trying to figure out how to travel with this newborn. This newborn, that sounded really bad. Your newborn. Travel with my newborn, our newborn. Travel with Haley, trying to figure out the plane, the stroller, all that good stuff. So, we definitely have a full day in front of us. Gonna be lugging these things around. Gonna have the stroller, diaper bag, backpack. So, wish us luck. We're gonna bring you along today. Let's do this. What did you forget? My purse. Thankfully, I have your passport, but you don't, don't have, have your license. I don't have any credit cards. Hey. <laughs> We're off to a bad start. Entrance, wrong way. What are you doing? Oh my word. Kate's already unpacking the suitcase and we haven't even gone five steps. Forgot my purse. Forgot Haley's blanket in the car. I'm struggling this morning. Sleep, depri sleep deprivation does something to you. Packing with another human is like a whole nother ball game. So we have two suitcases. They can be 50 pounds, so that's nice. But I'm at a weight check here. Gonna see how we did. All right, that looks really weird on camera, but it says 45 pounds. Beautiful. That's your bag, so good job. Mine and Haley's stuff, so I'm proud of myself. Oh, so light. This has got to be like 30 pounds. 32 wait, wait, wait. pounds. All right. Why are you trying every little thing? <laughs> <laughs> what was that? My sock is messed up. All right, so we made it past our first thing to do. We checked the bags. Oh yeah. It Haley's went been an angel. Yeah, it went really well. And also good news, we found out that we can gate check the stroller. So we didn't know if we'd have to drop it off there and carry her around the whole time. So uh, we'll take that. Oh yeah, maybe we should have hit the bottom. So and I almost went on the escalator like a dummy. And Katie's like, you can't have an we escalator have in the stroller. So we get special treatment. We got our private little elevator here. I'm just embarrassing Katie because walking around this airport with this camera filming, I just know she loves it I so hate much. It. <laughs> and I'm already embarrassing myself because I am struggling today. <laughs> nah, it's so fun. Like, we're making memories. The first time flying with a newborn, like, what? Guys, for real though, people treat you so much nicer when you have a baby. Literally. It's insane. Oh, yeah, we're pregnant. Currently walking to uh, the security checkpoint. And what's really nice about this is that we both have pre-check, so we get to keep our shoes on, we don't have to take stuff out of our backpacks. I'm not sure what we'll have to do with Haley. I think they give you pre-check if you have a baby. I don't know, I hope we don't have to unbuckle her because she's sleeping so good. I'm kind of wishing she was sleeping like this last night, but it's fine, I'll take it in the airport. Hopefully you guys can hear us because the airport is a little noisy, so fingers crossed you can hear anything we're saying right now. I did give ourselves ample time. I even... <sighs> Told Katie we couldn't stop at Starbucks on the way 
because I wanted to be here extra early. We'll go in the airport. We'll go in the airport. Yeah, and then I just found out that there's no Starbucks on the other side of security, so. So guilty now. Katie's shedding a tear. <laughs> yeah. Moment of silence. All right, we made it through airport security. Guys, this airport is like a ghost town. There's nobody in here, which I'm Nobody's super sued. thankful for. I guess I'm a little too worried about people, but I hate holding other people up or being an inconvenience to other people. And like that security line, they made us take Haley out of her stroller and everyone gets backed up. She had the baby, so I'm like lugging this Duna stroller car seat thing. So we're doing pretty good. We uh, made it through security. Now we are headed to the gate and maybe try to find some food for Kate. She's getting a little hangry over here. What time is it? It's 9... 9.30, but I haven't ate anything all day. Flight doesn't leave until 11. It's time to get hype. We're getting ready to go see the fam bam. Up at 6.30. Up at 6.30. Earliest I've been up since Haley and like stayed up. Option one, we have the Ironbound Street Market. Yes or no? Oh. Or you have the street. It's like a dad joke, like a play on words. Get it? Street, but it's E A T. Oh, yeah, that's funny. Funny. Are you on my eyes? <laughs> You're not funny. Kate found some breakfast. Got me a blueberry muffin. Blueberry muffin. Some cranberry apple raspberry juice. Get it? <laughs> Vitamin C. <laughs> we need that. Haley has still not woken up yet, so. I don't know if that's good or bad. She must have got her nights and days confused because she was awake last night and not having the whole sleeping thing. And today she is out cold. So I guess it's good for today because we're in the airport and it's a busy day, but we got to get them fixed again. What will be really bad though is if she sleeps all morning and then the second we get on the plane, she starts to lose it. I'm going to have to go full dad mode if that's the case. Like full on tapping her butt. Like, soothing her. I can be my own noisemaker. Shh, in her ear. Hmm. All right, we are about an hour away from takeoff. So far, so good. Katie is gonna start feeding Haley uh, in a little bit before we get on the flight. But I wanted to take a minute and thank Seed for sponsoring today's video. Uh, if you guys remember, I don't know when that was, like a, a few weeks ago? back, before we had a baby? That's oh, weird. Oh, to go then. That's so weird. Anyway, I showed you guys Seed, um, which is a DS1 daily symbiotic that I've been taking. Um, and I told you guys I was gonna do a follow-up after using it for a longer time. I've been feeling great I'm not even just saying that I actually have my travel pack with me right now So it's super convenient on days like this with all the traveling we're doing some of you guys actually said you were using seed So shout out to you guys and then some of you were also asking about if it's pregnancy safe and uh, breastfeeding, breastfeeding safe. safe DS1 is pregnancy and breastfeeding safe, but with like all changes, I always talk to my doctor before I start something new. But the answer is yes, it is pregnancy and breastfeeding safe. During my pregnancy with Haley and then now postpartum, I've really tried to stay on top of my gut health. Trav got me on it and like has me now dedicated. <laughs> I know Trav already shared it with you guys in detail, but the science behind this stuff and how it works is so cool. It's literally like amazing. The last thing I'll share uh, is something super cool. It's actually called micronutrient synthesis. Synthesis. Katie laughs at me because he I actually get into such it. A pro. He's so dedicated to this. Like he literally is like all in it. I love it and I know like the basics, but he knows like every in and out of everything. He can tell you everything about it. It has like what is it, 24 strains and wow, look at all this you, different babe. stuff. Impressed. 24 strains in the symbiotic, yes, but two of the strains are directly tied with that. I will admit I cannot pronounce these two strains. I'm gonna leave them on the screen for you guys. But I wanted to share this because it's really cool and important in pregnancy. Those two strains help support folate production and also the synthesis of vitamin B12, which is really important, important for you. Whether you're pregnant, postpartum, any stage of life, they are great 
great for you. We happen to have another code for you guys, which is awesome. We love being able to give you guys discount codes. So our code is Travis and Katie, and that'll get you 15% off your first month's supply of Seeds DS1 Daily Symbiotic. So I'm gonna leave all that info in the description. Go check it out, you will not regret it. Okay guys, they just said we are boarding. We are running over there. Didn't realize they started boarding this early, so we're gonna take the stroller, take the bags, and then I guess we have to carry her, and then we are gonna gate check the stroller. So um, I thought we were gonna be able to go on the plane first, like they normally say. If you have kids, now to customers traveling with small children to board. If you have a stroller or car seat, please sit at the boarding door at this time. We gotta go. Our first time on a plane. Walking off Haley's first flight. We finally woke up. How old is this one? It's a month today. Congratulations. She's so she... a little creamy though. Oh, she's gorgeous. <laughs> okay guys, so we just landed in Knoxville. Katie is actually changing Haley's diaper right now. So, um, guys, it went way better than I expected. She did not make a peep. Now, I know she's still young, so I guess that was to our advantage, but from the second we got on there, um, I immediately had to go and change her diaper in the little airplane bathroom, which was interesting, but she was fine. Didn't make a peep, brought her back out. Katie had a bottle ready for her uh, to try and help with her ears popping and things like that. Uh, she filled up her stomach, and it was about an hour and 40 minute flight, and she didn't wake up one time until we literally walked off the plane. So, she was actually smiling in her sleep. I tried to catch a video of it. You maybe have saw it already. Definitely a little relieved that it's done. It's so funny, everybody we see comments on Haley, like she's the star of the show. Um, the people next to us, the flight attendants, walking off the plane, people in the airport. No joke, everybody says something. It's so funny. People are so nice. Maybe it's because we're in Tennessee and people are nicer in Tennessee. I don't know, maybe that's it. We're gonna head to go get our bags. I'm gonna show you Haley and Katie. Um, there hasn't really been any cool footage. I was trying to do like a cool travel vlog, but we've been just trying to survive with Haley and the bags and diaper bags and strollers. So, um, sorry about that, but it's been fun. Hopefully you guys are enjoying it. And, uh, and then it's time to meet her family. So basically the majority of the family has not met Haley. So it's going to be a fun weekend, a good time. We'll bring you along. what do you think of your first flight, Haley? You're so awake right now. You're so pretty. So dumb. Looks like we'll be washing our clothes. No, I think that we just took too long because I had to change Haley's diaper and whatnot. So I think they literally are done with baggage claim, and I've never done that before. My man over here took Katie's bag on accident, so I'm bringing him his bag. I think we have the wrong bags. Ooh. Sorry, you don't want baby. I'm sorry. You right, yo. <laughs> Yo, I'm so sorry. No, don't worry about it. This has baby clothes and all sorts of I stuff. I remember. <laughs> oh, I'm so oh No, you're good. It worked out. I'm so sorry. You no, are fine. Do not even apologize. Have a good one. Guys, that's proof people in Tennessee are just overall nicer. That guy was so nice. He didn't even like. He was apologizing. I know. So sweet. What a nice guy. It's so different from Jersey. No, actually, there are a lot of nice people in Jersey. There are nice people in Jersey. It's just not this nice like there's everyone no way to sugarcoat is, it everyone here is like oh it's okay honey how are you like everyone will stop you look at your baby tell you how cute it is but they won't touch what a life okay you want to take a walk down memory lane like four years ago we'd sit in this exact airport Ooh. like actually they had chairs over there too that we used to sit i know i looked for them they I weren't there they moved them. it's insane mm. i was here well we did like every other month that's so crazy and now we're here with a baby what is, where is life going? I don't mean that in a bad way, it's just like. Time has flown by faster than you by. realize. I mean, I'm getting so old now, I just turned 22. It's like they say, so it's just like a blink, man. And we're just, we're just gonna be old parents. When you think about it, dating felt like it was forever. 
Like we felt like we were dating forever. And then now we've been married like That's 15 how it works. months. We have a child. When you look forward to things, they feel longer. Like the fact that Haley's one month today is crazy to me because the last four weeks of Katie's pregnancy felt like a yes. year. And now this flew by, but that's life. It's a good life though. So uh, we're waiting on a ride and then we'll be sure to show you all the family members that meet Haley. Not really sure who's in town. I know some people are away uh, and we'll be coming back and forth, but we will do our best to show you all the family meeting Haley this week. Um, Katie was saying we came for a week because some of the families in town and gonna be out of town. So we should be able to meet everybody. So we'll do our best. It's gonna be a good time. It's gonna be a good week. All right, Uncle Warden came over to pick us up. This is the <laughs> cutest baby ever. Oh, we got cutest baby ever status? Yes. Okay, she started basically. smiling at him, which she She's rarely never, does. She's never, ever done for me. Like, I I, she'll smile proof. when I'm like with her, but she's never like looked at me from me talking to her and her. smiled. Oh my goodness. She's Hang literally on. just cackling at him. Yeah, she'll smile in her sleep, but to like respond with a smile is- She's responding oh, to me with a smile. She looks so cute. We're getting ready to head over to uh, the Happy sister's here. boutique. They have an event today, so Warden picked us up. And there's gonna be a few people there. So it's gonna be Carla and Evan. She's gonna meet Michael and Brandon and Whitney and Zach for the first time. So I had to make her in a cute outfit. Oh so my goodness. That, oh, that's so I never call you Aunt Whitney. I can call her Aunt Whitney now because I have a kid. Oh, oh that's my so goodness. weird. I've never got to call you Aunt Whitney. Oh my goodness. It's oh. Her hair. Oh. It's her hair. Oh my goodness. Say, so I had a bath this morning so I could come meet everybody. Look how little. When you see her little hands. I feel like she's smaller than even my newborns. How like she is, like, mine are normally like seven, eight, or seven, ten. So she's seven, six right now. <laughs> and she's oh, like a month old. Her kids stay tiny forever. Oh, but like, she's well. more alert and stuff, so she's not in the newborn like phase as much because she'll open but her eyes. Does that make you want a girl? What? Zach already said he's the favorite uncle. Me and Evan are right up there. She I'm the favorite Bates uncle. Okay. He can be the favorite <laughs> stew uncle. She was <laughs> I'm stewing about this, Evan. <laughs> Yeah, what do you think? Sweet baby. I want to take her home is what I think. <laughs> I want to take her. You want to take her home too, don't you? You have so many aunts, Haley. So many aunts and uncles. I got to show her to Brandon. He's not seen her yet. <laughs> All the kids love Brandon. Like, he's the baby and kid whisperer. Forever. Hello. Do you like your Thank Aunt you. Addie? Oh, we're birthday, birthday like buddies. Your Addie? This is your birthday. Oh, oh my I forgot. This oh, is your birthday, birthday buddies. buddies. Look at us. Oh my goodness. I call my. We get to celebrate for life with Addie. <laughs> She's a lover's baby. I love her. She's so cute. Man, your face is growing up too. Why do all these kids look so old when I come back? What's up, guys? It is Sunday night. You guys all just saw footage of yesterday. Uh, we were at the cash and carry event I had mentioned, and Haley got to meet a, a lot, lot of her family. We went to the big house. Some of the kids were there. And uh, now we had church today. Got a good afternoon nap, and we're at Josie and Kelton's house for dinner. Kelton's also cooking, so definitely excited so about that. Excited. We got her all ready and cute to go meet her cousins. Just changed her diaper. We're gonna head in and meet them all. Ready? <laughs>
had a little mishap. Haley like never spits up and she like projectile spit up all over Josie, like all down her shirt. It felt so bad, it was pitiful. So we just got a little outfit change. I think we're feeling a little bit better. The whole bottle we drank is all gone. I don't know if it's something I ate or something, but I feel so bad, it was pitiful. It was like everywhere. Oh yeah, it's got a little pink in there, perfect. Taste test. Okay, Yo. that means it's good. Try it. <laughs> Try it. Okay, yeah. Just trying to make sure that was a good piece. Flavor's amazing. It's really good. No, it's really good. Are you good, Josie? <laughs> Get an okay, outfit so change? I'm sure you see the back. We're yeah, going down memory lane. Travis telling about all Literally. the first times he came to the house, he met the family, the film crew and everything. No, for real, we're almost to my family's house to introduce Haley to a lot of the family and then my parents are gonna get to see her again. So mom made a whole like dinner spread. A lot of the married couples are coming over and we're just gonna like hang out tonight. It's gonna be super fun. <laughs> the big red house. Travis, memory lane. I don't know, you're like a sentimental dad now. No, I'm not. It's just, it's just the first time pulling up to this house with a daughter. All right. <laughs> All right, guys, we are back at the big house. We got Haley over here, mama. She's getting fat over here. She's eating like a cow. Today is actually Tuesday. It's about four o'clock. So you guys will actually be seeing this video in about probably three hours. So um, I just finished watching the video with you guys. Saw that B-roll of Katie's baby book, which was super cute. I think the older Haley gets, the more she's starting she's to look like you. Like me. Haley was able to meet most of the family. Um, All the local people she got to meet. Yeah. But some of the people are out of state, so she couldn't meet them yet. But we're gonna plan a trip, and I'm sure she'll meet them eventually. We still have a few days here, but it's been a great trip so far. And uh, we're gonna end the video right here. But again, it's been a great time. Haley's doing so good. Mama's doing great. We are loving our time here in Tennessee. Thanks again for watching the video. We appreciate you guys. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Not sure when the next video will come out, but uh, Haley did want to tell you guys to subscribe. And, and peace hit out. that like button and peace out. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta block the whole screen. Your hand's not big enough.